So I really love folks to expand their sense of who was a suffragist um, and to think about um, sort of different women who fought for the right to vote and ask about why they were fighting. She had Those were the words of Dr. Um, Kathleen Cahill, uh, a Penn State professor of history, women's and gender studies. Dr. Cahill provided a space to explore what she considers to be the underrepresented side of the women's suffrage movement, that being the angle of the women of color who were involved. The professor attracted a modest crowd of 15 to listen to her presentation of history. Dr. Cahill also provided a free insight into her newest book titled Recasting the Vote, How Women of Color Transform the Suffrage Movement. Dr. Cahill gave an emphasis on the women of color when asked about what the main takeaways should be of her book. Sometimes it's pretty basic, right, questions of sex equality, but for the women that I write about, um, it also involved often questions of racial equality. Despite the fact that the novel covers events of the past, Dr. Cahill believes there is still work to be done regarding the advancement of women's rights as well as the rights of people of color. We still face uh, barriers. The Voting Rights Act, some of its um, provisions, the Supreme Court recently struck down. Um, and, you know, we've seen sort of um, recent ways in which the right to vote has um, been difficult, right? Questions around should there be universal voter registration, questions about mail-in ballots, um, you know, should there be a, a national day of voting. The Penn State professor claims that she is working to continue awareness so, and action for the cause that um, she has so much passion for. For PSN News, I'm Jackson Fortone.